Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it's season 16. Season 16, week number one. Friendly Fire against Slither. It's the first European cast. Uh, we are live streaming here. The, the first European match, actually. Um, I'm there and I'm not today. I'm here. I'm not. I'm not alone today. I'm here with Sokilo. Hello, hello. Hey, hello, Leander. How are you doing? <laughs> yeah, I'm doing fine. I hope you are also doing fine. Uh, thank you all for tuning in. I am really looking forward for this one. And it has been so long since we have been last week. casting it last time, right? I mean, how long was it? Two months? Oh my god. <laughs> it's uh, since uh, early January. We, we haven't had a, a, a games, but now we are back. And I want to say hello to everybody else that is tuning in to watch this match. It seems to be the very first one. EU uh, Streamcast from BRML in the new season week one. So we're going to be having a Good, good match with a lot of action, top teams, and I'm very happy to be with you. Exactly. Um, and I'm looking forward for this one because we have many new things happening today, right? Um, or in the season. We have a new map pool. We have some slight, some some little rule changes. And I mean, let's talk about the new map pool, right? Um, the, the map pool back then have, has been uh, 11 maps, and now it's 12. It's one more. It's the biggest map pool VML has ever had. It's, it's just one more map, but you know, it's really balanced now. We have four big maps, four medium maps, four small maps, and the, the two new yes. maps are uh, Abandoned and Suburbia. We got rid of Tanker, which is quite sad. I actually liked Tanker, to be honest, but uh, it had some problems here and there. Really. But now we have Abandoned and Suburbia. Uh, so can you tell us a bit about those two new maps? Oh, wow. Let me tell you. Yes, we have 12 maps now and uh, everything is looking uh, good and balanced. Like you said, abandoned. Very, very nice map. It got uh, recently fixed and it's ready for a, a professional matchups as we're going to uh, have now. Hopefully we they pick this map so, so we could have some action in there. We know it is a long range. Uh, it is uh, probably uh, snipers uh, yeah, people, yeah. you know, we're going to have a couple of snipers here and there and they are loving this new map that is being just added in in the in the official map pool and I like it too. Abandon has beautiful uh, um, uh uplinks positions very nice it's spread all over the map not that many but are very strategic and uh, we're gonna have new new action going on and also um uh, we have uh, uh suburbia as well is you know suburbia is one of the most popular maps that it's it's play in the game they usually start uh, love is opening with that map so it's a small map not too small but there's a lot going on in their streets uh, uh, sideways uh, indoors outdoors second floor uh, smokes and grenades are very useful in that map so we gonna have a lot of action and on the other hand we had uh, uh, tanker is out uh, which I probably won't miss it but probably if some of you will miss it uh, I as a player I don't and player and captain I don't pick that map at all but if the other team wants to play it I definitely know it but um, I don't really know don't know the reasons why the map is out but uh, it's not too bad. We we have two maps back in the map pool, and uh, I'm very happy about it. Uh, so yes, uh, what do you think about that? I agree you. To be honest, it has been quite a while since uh, I played Abandoned and Suburbia. Uh, I I can't wait to see them back in competitive. I I love them, so it's gonna be interesting. Maybe I'm I'm hoping we will see one of those maps today. Um. Yeah, that would be epic. Yeah, uh, it should be it should be good and fun. So yeah, Suburbia definitely as a small uh, one of the smallest map should be faster rounds sometimes, 
but uh, yeah, there's a lot of to do over there. Uh, there's, uh, you know, yeah, Sea Force also is, is also used in that map at all. Uh, uh, in 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 as a strategy as a defense and uh, a lot of window uh, hiding and peeking too so we'll see a lot of new stuff and hopefully we're gonna catch that action is that right yes yeah. yes you, you, you're so right uh, but i could be talking about those two maps like the next five hours let's talk about those teams instead right slither against friendly fire in my opinion two master i mean t two really good teams uh one of the best European teams, or internationally, um, Friendly Fire and Slither. I'm always struggling playing against them, to be honest, to be fair, right? Th th those are really good teams. I know Friendly Fire ended Season 15 placed uh, third, uh, which already says a lot, right? We, we don't have any stats for, for this season yet. It's, it's the first week, you know? Uh, we don't have any map stats. And the past stats... We, Let's not take them too serious. It was quite a while that I've scrimmed, I've trained other maps. So I don't know. I, I don't know what to expect today. Um, maybe Slither wasn't as active as Friendly Fire and this way Friendly Fire is able to beat them or reverse. You know what I'm talking about. It's it's going to be such an amazing and interesting game for me today, personally. I think both have a similar skill level. And they, they, they have been placed right uh, uh, somewhere... Yeah, next to each other on the on the leader on the leaderboard on the on the standings uh, season 15 um yeah I, I was showing you guys the, the 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 global standings but yeah those tell nothing it's the first week as uh, only a few teams have been playing two matches yet so nothing we can actually count on not we have no stats for the season um but we have the bands from Friendly Fire and Slither, and these are really interesting, right? Um, Friendly Fire banned Arctic and Cargo. Um, two really, I mean, two custom maps, and two really, really short, short, short maps. So I feel like we will not see as much uh, close action, close common action today, right? As we usually do, because we, we, we have all the custom short range maps banned. I mean, it's okay, talk about the Slither bands here. Oh, yes, uh, you just mentioned RT and Cargo. Yes, those are. Uh, uh, we won't be. Uh, we won't see them tonight. And uh, we also have a, a couple of bands from uh, Slither, and uh, they have banned, I believe, Chipyard and USS Quest. So yes, those are also custom maps. Uh, they just been recently updated. Uh, we don't know why, but uh, you must ban two maps. So those were their choice for Slither. And uh, yes, uh, most likely we're gonna have the original map in the game. So expect to see probably Downfall or Vassar. Maybe, hopefully we see Abandon and uh, Suburbia too. Uh, but whatever the issues will be there for you to catch the action and the captures of objective and uh, who will come victor I don't know but uh, we have two top teams in the EU and uh, it is happening pretty soon they are loading up in the lobby and they are putting the code and probably we're gonna start pretty soon um, how far are we from the game um, already yeah, we are pretty we close see? to it. We have, we have the lobby up. We, we know the first map. It's going to be Egress. I already put it down. It's, it's also an interesting one. Uh, in my opinion, a not too often played map in Season 15. It's also one of the newer maps. It's a, it's a newest uh, standard map coming with the game itself. In a current map pool. Um, the, the match will be starting yeah. soon. I guess we have said everything we need. Egress is a medium sized map. We have a lot of uh, actually large combat, but a lot of small combat uh, situations here. Uh, guys, we go into one minute ad break. Um, grab something to eat, to drink. We will also do that now. And then see you in a minute where we tune into the match. Stay tuned, guys.
and accept and ignore Just kicking down all the doors Guarantee you, boy, if I ask for it, it's gotta be real big I gotta make it just for my kids And for their kids, just kids, that's wealth, years and years Promise my brother, soon as he out and finish this bid We finna do it bigger than anybody ever did The odds is real big, job that's real big Satan trying a little, my God, is real big Stayed up on the grind on the cars, is real big I gotta do it big, the only way that I can live Back into the into the game into the scoreboard and the match is gonna start soon. Um, everyone is ready up actually. Um, and we know the first objective. Uh, Security, what do you think about the first objective, guys? I'm gonna blend you in and show you how it's looking here. Security, what do you think about this one? It's a, in my opinion, it's a really tricky objective, right? Oh, wow, well, this is Egress. It just, uh, it's a, a fairly new map. It's been out for a year, a year and a half. Original map. And uh, this uh, objective is in the open, but uh, don't be fooled about that. You could capture it on the other side of that door. Uh, uh, if you stand next to it, I you um only might show your feet <laughs> but yeah it will it, it, it should be able to capture the objective from indoors on that little corner and next to the door uh it's a it's a good uh well positioned objective there's cars around that you could uh, get cover on the other side of the curve of street uh there's a truck and more uh dividers uh uh, cement dividers uh, that I will give you cover and boxes as well and to get to it the Marshall team needs to cross the street or sneak through the two warehouses that you see in front is a very 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 uh, nice objectives and many ways to get in but uh, like I said, Marcel needs to get close, cross the street, get indoors, or you know, smoke their way out, in, the way in there, and uh, try to put that code, which we know it's a seven-digit code that is provided to you, uh, and you need to get closer within range. I believe within three meters from the, if you kind of calculate, I will say three meters from the objective uh, you need to get your tablet out and put the code in to win two points as Marsar and um, win that round um, we also know that uh, we need four points to win the map so it is either you kill everyone to uh, everyone in the other side and the other team to get one point or as Marsar you put the code and get two points so yes this is appling uh, and uh, it is the f the best uh, game mode in the game and uh, if you have skills this is where you show it so yes we are ready for it yes I agree with you and we are just waiting for the timer to start we are just waiting for the first round to start until then I'm gonna thank you all for tuning in. Everyone here in the chat, I see that the chat is really active. Uh, I love that. Hello, Chumbait. Yeah, our casting friends. You look at this Chumbait. We have Gray in here. But then we also have Mattress. We have Bubbleberry. We have uh, Jordan. Wow. Imperia. It's a. Uh, I love to see all of you in the chat. I'm pretty sure that there is a poll going on right now, which is saying who's going to win. Uh, take a part of that. Uh, share us your opinion, let us know, and give us your bets in the chats, say what you think. And we are now starting to the first round, Friendly Fire is defending, Egress, VMA Season 16, Week 1. This is gonna be epic. Yes, we have Friendly Fire as the bulk, and uh, you get a little bit of advantage. Uh, uh, if uh, you defend this, you should get the first point. And uh, that will um, 
get you in front. So there's more chances for the ball team to actually uh, win the round. So they better take control and uh, do the right move, uh, right call outs to, to, to actually to work. I agree with you here. And look at this. We maybe actually have a, a contact here between Chocolate and Rogue Dice. Uh, that there was one. Oh, the C4 throw. There was actually a. He let it explode a little bit too early. Slither was already able to pick off one of the friendly fire defenders. And look at this. A five man stack here. Four man stack. It's a, it's a four against five. As Slither is not having the full rose up playing here tonight. I mean. They only have five players, right? Take take a look at this. Uh, meanwhile, other yes. teams like Friendly Fire have eight players. Uh, Slida has five, which means I can actually imagine ske scheduling being a quite of a pain. With, with, for, 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 uh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> uh, Slider has a five uh, roster team, so probably they're all here. Or they might be missing one. I don't know, but uh, they have decided to play um, get a, a, the south approach going around the map to get to objectives so let's see how they do they still are good four of them are alive but we have a couple of the friendly fire team on them they won't let them pass exactly we have idiots oh i'm just gonna call him hood uh, cookies an idiot a team kill what doggy killing yeah, dog what, what? <laughs> I'm, I'm it confused. It was a mistake. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and it happens. Doggy got a TK, but uh, hopefully uh, they uh, solve this and do something with the uh, players that they have left. Yes. Actually, I see that the names are wrong. Uh, Friendly Fire is, is attacking right now. Friendly Fire is a team of uh, Oh, you players. are right. Let yeah. me help you with that. <laughs> oh, no. Keep going. Mr. <laughs> This is not able to trade them off. Look at this. Chocolate able to kill Doggy Dog from behind. Um, it's a one against four. It's not looking too good. A lot of things happened here. A, a, a team kill. Whatever this was. A, a really awesome peek from Chocolate here. Um, wow. Yeah, Fisic. Uh, he's the last player. They. Uh, it's, it is. It's, it looks like it's been a, a bad start for Friendly Fire. But uh, don't worry about it. It's just the first round. They are a professional gamers, and uh, I'm pretty sure they're gonna give a good five to this leader team. I I follow you there. It's it's gonna be. An awesome match, and this is the first round, and it's one of the hardest and trickiest objectives to defend, in my opinion. It's a it's a really tricky one, and especially with the spawns. Uh, friendly fire just said, I'm getting confused at the wrong uh, by the names in the wrong order. Sorry, yeah, yeah I'm, I'm <laughs> getting that. I'm gonna help you. I'm gonna put their names you. right right now. And. I mean, what do you do in this one against four situation? I, I wouldn't know, to be honest. Uh, I would panic around and... Physics is just clearing every possible corner an enemy could be sitting in. And it's now going to peak well, this ramp here, which is... Well, if you are by yourself and there's many of the other team, it's kind of... Um, it's going to be... We know it is pretty hard to uh, beat the other team but it is also um because it's the first round uh it's kind of important to give a good uh game for your teammates so hopefully they have not just a game experience not just really good endurance in the way of thinking because they're gonna need it uh to come back from this Exactly. It's it's all about the next round. And the devolk advantage is huge, you know, uh, especially on Egress, in my opinion. On this OBJ, the, the team starting on Vogue maybe has a a little advantage. Um, it, they just have to yeah, hold it. It is, it is, it is. If you are bulk and you are really uh, put up a good defense and win all the bulk rounds, 
and you're gonna be able to actually just win with just that winning bulk rounds but uh we don't know we don't know what's gonna happen uh it's still very early in the match and uh let's go let's see how this ends yes and this is gonna be interesting now look at this physics is going to peek outside of the hotel you know none of the defenders actually watching this but mr morph or bernie uh, i think that was a call just happening and Free fire and a trade. Oh. First point for friendly fire. Oh my god. Oh, there was a chance. There were two of the leader team uh, near objected, but uh, that was a trade. The round is over. Yeah, the, the pre fire was slightly off. I, I, I don't remember who exactly it was. Yeah, physics. It was physics. The, the pre fire was off. He pre fired the wrong door or the. Yeah, the, the wrong direction of the, the hangar, if you prefer the right direction, this would have been maybe ending different. This way, um, Freddy Fire was able to only kill one of the Slither's defense here, which is quite frustrating, man. This, this was, in my opinion, a, a really good defense from Slither. What do you think? Uh, who oh who had the strongest... Uh I, I mean, I didn't notice any mistakes here from Slither's defense, right? Uh, Cookie's position there behind those boxes uh, I just called out earlier. That, that, that was an epic, that was an epic position. I didn't see it often. Um, uh, and I mean, in the end it was right. They had two, three player, players placed exactly where uh, Friendly Fire spawned and ran into. Really good defense. What yeah. do you think? Also, uh, you need to understand Friendly Fire started as a Marshal with four players uh, and they had a TK. Uh, physics got really close to objective. Probably he would have used a smoke at the door or in the center of the, uh, between the warehouses. He just needed to take care of one of the defenders and probably should be able to cap but it didn't happen uh first round it, it was chaos for them but uh it, this is just the beginning we're gonna have more action pretty soon exactly yeah something i totally forget is it was a four against five and then a team kill so it makes this a three against five uh it's a uh, it was an unlucky round luckily uh friendly fire has the opportunity to Turn the dice around now, right? It's a. F what? It's, is it a five against five? Yes. Brave Fire was able to get their fifth player, and they are defending now the same objective. And well, personally, I'm hoping for this match to be a really close one, a really intense one. Uh, obviously, right? We always want a third map decider. So I'm. <laughs> I don't know. What, what, well, the yeah. Yeah, the, the ball side won the first round and uh, it just uh, we just had a reset of round because it looks like friendly fire last player just joined. So they are getting getting ready for the second round. And uh, let's see, it should be a fair fight now. Let's see, second round starting now. Slither attacking this one. They have the far end park spawn here. It's the um, it's the one in the all the way in the back. I mean, in my opinion, kind of the worst one. But at least you have the opportunity to do to attack from everywhere you want, without being in need to flank around. And the, the, the vote just ended, by the way. There was a voting going on. Who will win this? Uh, it was actually close. Fifty-five percent for Fanny Fire, forty-five for Slither. Well, according to the community, Friendly Fire is going to take this on today. I'm looking forward, man. It's gonna be all epic. And look okay. at this four man push, five man, five man push here. It is, uh, yes, they are, uh, once again, they are going through the south. Um, and, uh, we don't see any bulk with C force right now, but, uh, we might, uh, get a surprise later, yes. It seems like it's either they're gonna be uh, approaching it slowly, and uh, this way, most likely, they're gonna be able to hit one by one. Um, uh, so they are, you know, pushing close to each other, uh, and something happened with one of the Marsoc, the other one should be able to refract and find the player. 
to terminate him. So let's see, it's still uh, very early and is slow. It's, it's, uh... it's a slow one, but I feel like Doggy Dog now should be able to hear those steps happening. Take a look at this. He's slowly, he's slowly peeking this maybe soon. If he hears more steps, is he getting? Yeah, it does, does, does a really good position because you could just stand up and hit that line straight from him and you could hear whoever is walking next to, the, uh, on the other side of the wall. So, and luckily for these two over here, they will soon find out that they're all here. Yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> oh. Look at this, he's... Doggy Dog cannot peek this one. Uh, Mr. Moth would be able to see him and... Get him, maybe Deadpool. Is Deadpool having an angle on him from here? Oh, if he's... Whoa! Look how close this is. That's insane. But uh, at the same time, look at Miss a lot and Chocolate. I don't know how long Doug it will take. Yeah, Doggy is making a beautiful uh, uh, holding position. Staying low, being alert. Uh, tablet is on the ground, so he won't make any noise. Oh, oh look at that! Yes, yeah, so right. Oh, and the frag from. <laughs> you see, I was telling Have you, you that, that is a frag. <laughs> Yes. Take a look at his replay. Two amazing plays here. Cookies confirming him now. Mister Lot is rotating back, I think. Oh, uh, what she a wants to get out <laughs> the danger zone. She loved a friendly, and um, and uh, I don't know if there was a um, confirm of that kill or a call out, but uh, the rest of the team they don't know that uh, Slither they lost a player. Uh, yes, wow, that that was an amazing play here. It was a mistake from Deadpool, flank, uh, uh, peeking this, ramp that hard, and look at this, Mr. Moff killing Cam. It's a, it's a three against four. But the, the, the frag, uh, I'm speechless. Look at Moff, is he, oh, Physic, is he, he's peeking him. <laughs> and oh Physic is God. killing him with one hand, but what's happening here? One hand to kill, but... Uh, we have only one ball left. Yeah. I, I feel like we didn't, we didn't promise too much with this match today. A lot of things happening. It's only physics left. Miss a lot. Also got killed by chocolate. Um, physics is, for sure, panicking right now. If you're the last one left on uh, Vogue, you you have the. You have well, the responsibility uh, uh, for the uplink, you know. I'm, I'm always feared. Oh no! If the, I mean, just imagine three smokes being on the uplink now. The, the, the pressure you have is insane, um, and it's, a, it's a lot yeah. about keeping a clear head, especially in this situation. It's a one against three, um, exactly yeah, like you, last round. Justin woke now. It's, we, we're yeah, gonna you see are right. Head. Yeah, you are right. He's moving around, uh, rotating within the area. Which um, uh, somebody's gonna see him uh, pretty soon, and uh, he might be down. But uh, who knows? He might get lucky. Uh, onward timing happens all the time. Uh, it's about who see who first. So, so yes. And uh, if he clashes this, could be a, a tie game. Ah! Oh, God. oh no. Yeah, Chuck was waiting for him. He heard those steps coming towards him. GG's. It's leaders too. Friendly fire zero. Yeah, but what, what a round this was, man. I actually need to correct the scoreboard uh, because of the uh, first round. I got confused with the names. Uh, the, the scores are 2-0 two, two, oh, in favor for Slither. And, man, let's just appreciate the uh, grenade. Uh, the grenades Thriller is throwing here, like, wow. Yeah. I feel like they trained us a lot, right? Where to throw the grenades, which spots, the timing, that, that's insane. That was, uh, like I said, he had a nice uh, position covered behind those, uh, that wooden uh, um, part of the map next to the wall. He got the first kill, but they... 
figured out where he was, saw a nade fly into his direction and uh, took him down. A beautiful nade, and uh, yes, uh, they did it. They did it. They, they are ahead. Yeah, it's uh, wow. Now, uh, now, friendly fire has to pull back. They have to pull it back. Um, it's still the first map, but I. This is really a slither dominant map so far, right? Yeah, um, slither, um, they are doing fine right now. So tell me, uh, the, who is the home team and who picked the, the map? Home team for this one is Friendly Fire. Um, they, they picked this map and so far it's not ending looking good for, for their map pick. Um, Let's talk about this objective, because Slither is now having the ultimate killer objective. If they are able to pull this off, then the it, scores are 3-0. And this is, in my opinion, the, the, the hardest one to attack. I'm taking back what I said in the beginning. It's the hardest one to attack. Um, there, there are two ways to enter this objective. Two doors. Um, it's, it's so tricky. And look at the defense, how close they are to each other. Um... Sorry for the oh, sorry for the quiet uh, game sounds. It's fixed. Let me know if any sound things are wrong in the chat. I'm gonna adjust it. And wow, well, round three is here. Doggy and uh, Miss Lot already next to the building. Uh, we got Mister down in the parking lot, uh, hiding behind a car, uh, aiming. Uh, under the cart, whoever's gonna walk in. Oh, oh my god, miss a lot. She saw him. They saw each other. Yeah, they saw each other. So, uh, and uh, something's gonna go down soon, right here. Doggy dog, and killing him. What a teamwork this was. Look at this. Miss a lot failed to uh, kill him, gave the call out, and in the exact same moment, Doggy dog knows what to do and is reacting. Sorry. Yeah, but that yeah. was stunning. <coughs> Miss a lot uh, exchanging fire with the defender in the parking lot, but uh, we have his uh, partner next to her uh, getting that uh, position, being alert of that position, so he got that kill. Doggy did, and uh, he is uh, uh, helping the team. They got one down, and there's four more to go. But Miss a lot and Doggy Dog. For sure, don't know is uh, Bernie also being down here. I mean, who would expect oh. this, right? You just killed one down here. You wouldn't expect a second uh, one to be him, right? And look at the spot. Uh, like, how did they can't see him? Oh my god, he is quiet in there, and uh, most likely he is gonna make some <laughs> damage to the other team. And again, miss a lot because she didn't expect it. Like, I. Exactly. Sorry, I, I missed that action. I was. Laughing at the position uh, of the way Bernie's character was looking. That was insane. It's a uh, 4 against 3 you now. And uh, Cam managed to down three. cookies. It's a uh, 4 against 3.5. Actually, in favor for Friendly Fire at the moment. Which is. Uh, I'm looking forward for this one. But let's go down back here again right because this is also an interesting situation meanwhile rogue dice and physics are trying to entry through the uh, Underground, hotel entry to the main entry where you can see the parking lot and if he's able to get past burning then it's actually getting quite op because there's only chocolate on the uh <laughs> so with the timing so okay, you yeah, didn't. two minutes. Uh, I'm frustrated. Yeah, two minutes, the camera. thirty seconds to go. Down, they're on the ramp inside. Hey, be careful. Anyways, two minutes and twenty seconds now to go, and uh, there was some wisdom uh, words from uh, one of the Slither team just to have control. So um, just be patient and uh, be alert of your surroundings. Uh, make sure you are able to listen right and pick up whoever is coming. Uh, next to you, so so you get that kill and help your team out. It's a three-three now. Exactly, control is the most important thing of this object uh, objective. 
Um, oh, you can't God. let enemies inside of here, and if you do, it's getting hard for you, you know. Uh, that would be too risky. And they just saw Bernie. A friendly flash! Oh no, he's killing Cam! Oh, what? Three kills! Oh my. <laughs> Bernie oh. with two kills right in front of the two free kills. Nice, kids. yes. Very Whoa. nice. Ending and the leader, they are ahead. Good job for them. Many things happening. Uh, I, I, I'm struggling to capture everything that's happening. Um, what I was about to say uh, on this objective is it's 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 really important to net to not let any master class inside the hotel because uh, it's so it's so small inside of there and two free smokes can block your whole vision and you don't have control anymore and once enemies are inside of the uh, hotel it's really dangerous and you might get a cap so you have to be aware of that and that's why they gave the call out what you just mentioned that people need to take the control and don't never let anyone inside of there and it looked like a friendly fire win. Friendly fire had the player advantage, the position advantage, but then something, uh, I don't know what it was. The, the, the team made the friendly flash, stopping uh, friendly fire, the, the one dude who entered to, uh, to kill. Who was the one who got three kills? Was it Bernie? Yeah, to, to get the kill. And then Rogue dies, peaked the wrong direction, also died. And then the last one, Cam, I guess it was. What do you think? What was wow. the mistake there? How, how was well, such an it, advantage being turned over by Sega? It, it's uh, I was saying earlier, Friendly Fire in a chaos uh, uh, overall on this map, they started with four players and they lost probably because of that the first round. Now, uh, too bad. This is their map pick. Friendly Fire picked this map, so we expect them to do a, a good job have some points in there but he hasn't gone their way but it's still not over you could come back for a old from a 0-3 uh, um, uh, point so and right now they have a very hard job uh, objective is indoor and uh, and um, what happened in the last round they couldn't um, get in there they didn't get close to objectives so let's see what as leader are gonna do uh, maybe they have uh, a, a different strategy they actually do they are not in the parking lot area uh, so we're gonna see a different round let's hope for a uh, friendly fire to do their thing and maybe put up a point or two uh, very soon in this map so it's friendly fires pick uh, that they should be able to get one point here and as you mentioned the defense seems to be slightly different only one is in the parking area and mr lot is in the hangar here and this is gonna be interesting now as soon as one of the five slither attackers are going to pick that one the, all of them are here went through the south cam is able to get that pool uh, i'm I will, i'm focusing on mr lot here because that's honestly so interesting she's able to hear oh, all of them God. i'm pretty sure it's just a question, uh, is Miss a lot able to just stay just in, sh in her position or will she peak? Which should be the mistake here, I guess, right? No, that's a great position that I will be there uh, because uh, you could see and uh, you could hear around you uh, three of them already passed them which uh, they might be stuff for that guy over there on the left. I don't get to see who it is. But uh, yes, they got this thing well covered. They haven't got close to the building. So this is really good for friendly fire and maybe they might be able to get their first point in this map. Exactly, because I think this uh, defense looks actually solid, right? Uh, I, I, don't see any, I don't see any mistakes on the defense. Um. Anything that annoys me, there's nothing. And now Mr. Lord is able to kill idiots. Anybody was picking the uh, scaffolding. Look at this. Who, who will pick this one first? I'm just gonna good. stick to this situation here. Because as soon as Mr. Lord is peeking outside of the box here, 
Miss a Moth. Miss a Lot. Yeah. With the very first kill uh, in this round. So uh, uh, we have those two marks. So they already know somewhat is in there. And it is really hard because there are so many places to hide. Uh, and Flash, you might think Flash might do the job, but um, no. And uh, one more kill for her. Mister is down. It's a lot in trouble. Oh, a third kill. Wow, very nice. The fourth, maybe? I don't know. My yeah! Opinion, you know. Oh my god, oh it's another god. with a four kill. Th oh, that's another replay. Nice, nice. Not all of those kids <laughs> are in here, but... What? <laughs> Miss a lot. Very, wow. Very nice job. First point from Friendly Fire. Look at that. And uh, yes, and uh, yeah, things are looking different. Is their map and um, they supposed to win and you know. And uh, let's see what they do. Maybe they get a capture and tie the game. Who knows? Um. Speechless, honestly. The, the position from Mr. Lord was epic. Mr. Lord was able to kill four of them. Um, and Slither, honestly, didn't really react to, uh, to, to the, the first kill. Mr. Lord did a kill within the first minute and a half of the, of the round. Uh, Mr. Lord killed Idiot. I, I remember that. And none of the Slither players rotated around and tried from where this kill was coming from. Maybe communication issues or sound issues. They didn't realized that the sound was coming from right maybe maybe that was the mistake so in the end what i did when mr lord killed the second enemy they they just looked around and one by one went into the hangar and went inside mr lord's trap and it's an insane position insane play wow what do you think yes yeah mr lord did a great job she got lucky just uh confronting them one by one uh got the first kill and then everybody went to her direction trying to look for her i was uh, saying something about flashing inside of uh the warehouse that probably could uh, blind her and uh they should be able to find her but they didn't use any utilities too bad we have a new round and uh let's see if there is a capture and we also have a new objective. It's it's quite oh, interesting yes. to see this objective when enemies have to quick spawn. In this case, they do not. Friendly fire attacking this one. <laughs> a, a five man push to the south so far. If nothing is changing, wow, oh, wow, wow, wait, a lot is changing. <laughs> I take back everything I just said. Uh, two, three split, rogue dies. Taking the south, uh, four one split actually. Wow, too many wrong calls here from me. That's uh, embarrassing. <laughs> uh, look at this. Miss a lot and chocolate will have an encounter soon. Uh, I wouldn't expect such a attack, honestly. Like, uh, well, we yeah, we have a new objective. Is the the mechanic shop area over there? And uh, yes, again, they are uh, pushing slowly, uh, four of them, and the other one is uh, kind of flanking uh, away from them. But uh, my preferred way to go into this kind of uh, medium and large side maps is uh, kind of ra run or rush a little bit halfway there and then start slowing down and to be more careful. Um, but uh, because they did um, go slow, they let the ball team uh, uh, get in uh, on the other side of the street. We have we see him right here on the other side of the wall uh, of the gas station store area, and uh, something's gonna happen pretty soon. Chuck and Miss a lot will face each other. Um, uh -huh. I was also thinking uh, Chalk is behind this container there, but Chalk is actually oh, he is <laughs> inside he's here. He's indoors as well, yeah, yes. But, uh... Yeah, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Uh, Chalk is ready. He's quiet and very well covered. And uh, he did that in previous rounds too, so he might surprise this friendly fire team. Yes, Mr. Lot is now going inside. 
Chocolate is able to hear me a lot. And the encounter will happen soon. Oh! Chocolate killing me. What the kill this was? But okay, am able to trade? No. Oh, suppressed fire. Not letting okay. anyone go through that door, but uh. Uh, C4, luckily, oh. uh, we have Cam, he was un uh, well covered under the desk, wow. And a trade, no, not a, not a, not a trade, chocolate killing the second. <laughs> what? Oh my god, friendly fire has been um, reduced to two players, they need uh, to do something and they need to stay alive. It's still a lot to go, 2 minutes and 40 seconds, uh, uh, but these two are far apart from each other, so they are on their own. Oh I'm my god, alive. another one is down, so Doggy, the last one, alive, <laughs> and uh, he needs to fight four of them. Very, very hard task. Okay, the Chocolate did an amazing job here. Um, what I said with uh, in the beginning, I don't agree. I I don't like this attack. Is um, they've been just all together pushing a rush and dying from one player. You know, that's uh, I don't know. Just imagine oh, if Chocolates C four would be hitting. Uh, he, he threw it unluckily, but I, but you saw it in my cast. Chocolate threw a C four and it was amazing. Could have been able to kill two players, three players with the right timing. <laughs> but look at this now, Doggy yeah. Dog, the last man alive. Well, Doggy is just new in the area. He doesn't know about Chuck and all the damage that he did. Now, uh, yeah, they hurt each other. And he still needs to cross the street to try to even uh, get close to the objectives. But is that uh, cross is well covered. Um, I don't know what will happen, but still not over. A minute more to go, and Doggy trying to figure it out what's the best way to do uh, make some damage. Just, uh, actually, Doggy is maybe getting flanked from idiot here, but that was able to kill it him. It's a four point. For Slither, the uh, the first map is over. Slither winning this one. Good job, by Slither winning their map, their uh, the other team's map, and uh, yeah, good job. Um, good job. This was a perfect defense, in my opinion. Um, they had everything covered, um, and so far, I'm actually seeing both teams performing absolutely great. Both teams have a beautiful performance and. They have beautiful spots they take, and the attacks they take are mostly really, really it's insane. The, the gameplay, the, the, the skill level we see today is nice. Um, of the, there are some little mistakes, and in the end those mistakes are costing Friendly Fire the, the rounds. I think I mentioned the most of it, but uh, I hope oh, the second map is getting closer, right? Well, I, I, it went bad from the beginning. They they started with four players. They losing uh, really bad. Um, in the first round, will will get uh, into your head. You kind of if you ever lose, you know, the first round you you actually want to do a good performance. So so it will keep up the same spirit for the rest of the map but uh it didn't happen that was a terrible first round but it, it's just the first map there's two more to go friendly fire could come back even win this series and uh let's see what they do oh wow oh wow we are have a new map i agree with what you just said and it was a frustrating beginning for friendly fire right um but now they have time to reset, they, they, they can reset their mindset now and another thing that's new um, between season 15 and 16 is Bazaar. Bazaar got an amazing graphics update and Bazaar is actually going to be 
map number two. Take take a look on those on those epic graphics now. I, I feel like it's one of the best looking maps, right? What do you think about the the new update? Oh, the way bazaars yeah, are looking. Yeah, they were talking about it uh, for um, a couple of weeks before the last update. Bazaar is being uh, redone. It's better. There's new stuff going on in the map. Uh, new trucks. I uh, I think they're. Uh, three different ones uh, there's more uh, stuff on the wall on the ground there's a uh, um uh, in the plaza in the in the main plaza there's new new details it makes the map beautiful uh you could also see the palm trees are better and uh cables that goes around uh, electric cables that goes all around are uh, actually they make sense now they connect to buildings and to the other poles so it is uh it is better uh, we have concrete barriers and um and we have uh, uh um, trucks and barrels that are new a few new walls and uh that uh will um w they weren't there before and uh, yeah, different stuff. It is a, a, a great map, a, and it is now even better. GG saying good job for the the downpour team that uh, fixed this all this for us. Yeah, Let's nice see. map. But uh, let's take a look how this team are doing in in Bazaar. Uh, well, we don't have records just yet, but uh, we could take a look on the season before. Let's uh, let me. Let me review this. Important to know this is Slither's pick, which means Slither did now chose the map. But, and I feel like Bazaar is. I have never actually heard someone hating on Bazaar. My, it's a great map, right? In my opinion. Um, I, I feel like many teams are experienced there. It's for sure not a problem for Friendly Fire now that we are playing on this map. That they're there playing on this one. We're setting out to round number one. A new objective. Uh, obviously a new objective, a new map. And the second. But it's the second map. And it's the easiest one to. One of the easiest ones to defend. Um, in my opinion. It's. Uh, I love this objective. Pre fire from uh. Miss a lot in case Slither is having the quick spawn. Which I don't. They spawn all the way back here. Yeah, it's a slither. This is a slither map, and uh, let me tell you, they in the last season they played this map seven times and they won five of them. So they love this map. So uh, that's why we they picked it. So uh, hopefully um, uh, they uh, if they do well, they might win the series. But uh, friendly fire won't let that happen. Exactly right. Um, they pull off a good fight. I'm, I'm pretty sure. And take a look on this defense from Friendly Fire. I I, I feel like it's it's totally solid. I it's a it's a meta defense. People often do. Nah, not even. Look at this. Two people in the objective building. That's a. I like this. Uh, this map could get get captured really quick you know you only need to be there at the corner and have one smoke to do it yeah. uh, a smoke uh, um, grenade so uh, you want to avoid that but uh, once again everything's going uh, slow uh, as leaders pushing slowly uh, hopefully they will get their angles and uh, and uh, they might um, do their thing but uh, friendly fire they need to win this map so we could have a more exciting third map Hundred yeah. uh, percent. It's slow. Right now, Slither is doing this really slow. They they are getting really. Look at this. It's almost a line they have been creating. And what they are doing is getting positions and l actively looking for friendly fires, exposed defenders. For example, Rogue dies peeking out of one of those doors, or um, Doggy Dog maybe over peeking the blue room. It's it's a game of patience, and. 
if friendly fire would do the mistake to get impatient and actively peek something, over peek something, they would have a problem because Slither is uh, is ready. So what they're doing now is slowly, slowly, slowly getting into the objective or near to it. Without yeah, any contact yet. But there's now a smoke coming ahead, which tells the position at least. Doggy Dog is able to uh, hear the smoke and see it actually. The whole Slither team is on the south side of the map and they are getting to cross the street. Uh, um, they, you usually expect somebody trying to sneak through the, the the plaza area, the Kiat building, but none of them are over there, which is different. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, wow. It was just a pre-fire. It's, it's just a pre-fire. I was confused. It's just yeah. a pre-fire. Oh. Blue room door right here. Doggy and Mister is gonna... They're they're gonna get it on pretty soon. Doggy yes. with a nice key position, which is guarding that uh, corner and uh, back entrance to the blue room, and also the front uh, gate area of the of the little market, uh, the east market. So he is a key player as well. Look at this. He is now going to entry, maybe. <coughs> Maybe. <laughs> Not yet. But this is gonna be a. Uh, this is gonna be interesting. Get him. Oh! I, oh no, I was about to call out the team kill. Just uh, one uh, healing. Two or <laughs> three years smoke in the area will get people confused. Miss a lot getting idiot. Cookies. <laughs> what a name to to have, but uh, we don't we don't judge, and uh, yeah. Monk is saving Doggy's his down. life. Look at this, the smoke is oh. saving Mr. Moss' life. It's wow. Three against three. And only Mr. Lot left on the objective. Where we see smokes? Do they have more smokes? Can they block their vision? No! Oh, there it all. Mr. Lot is killing Deadpool. Amazing, amazing gameplay here so far. And now it's a 2 yeah. against 3 in favor for Friendly Fire. Yeah, here's when it, it is the best idea to use the smoke out of objective. When you create a smoke panic and people run around to see and cover the area that they don't see and then you might be able to pick one or two players trying to see what's going on uh but uh yeah we have a 2v1 miss salad getting the last kill bernie is dead and friendly fire for the first time ahead in the match ggs let's let's appreciate what what miss a lot is doing here uh four kills from miss a lot that was insane and then the other round where miss a lot also killed four of the uh, attackers. Wow, Mr. Lot has some amazing positions, and it feels like Mr. Lot has the best feeling for the for the game. One of the best players, feeling-wise for the game. You know, Mr. Lot peaked every player in the in the perfect timing, and the, the awareness is insane. The, the uh, defensive positions here, Flame Fire had. That's amazing. Uh, two players on the uplink uh, room, which is something I actually don't remember seeing. Maybe it's something of people are doing often. I honestly don't remember it, but I've never seen oh, it. Um, and it yeah, worked you out well. Have, yeah, you want to have two players in there somewhere uh, because uh, if one fails, somebody could get in there real quick and cap. But the second one could take. Uh, over uh, the area and Misala getting uh, a good round once again, making a difference for her team, uh, which I hope inspires them to keep going and maybe tie the series and so they could give us a nice final map. Oh man, I like those even better if the last map is the decided with 3-3 three, three even in points. <laughs> Let's see what happens. 
uh, now Slither's attacking this. Uh, the, the same objective in round number two. Yeah, it, you can sit right, right here. You can just, like, sit behind the wall and then just right. look through that lower... Again, lower and it's, uh... It's a tricky one to attack and defend. Once uh, Master Player is able to push through, through through the main market, get inside of the store, two smokes can can be the can be the cap. You know, it's. Uh... Yeah, in the last round, uh, Marsoc didn't use a smoke on objective, which, like as I always say, he, 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 he will create a smoke panic and people will yeah, run around that thinking that they're gonna quick cap. But uh, yeah, it didn't happen. It should be a different uh, kind of round now. Um, uh, places has switched, so let's see what they do. And there's the first kill. Minus one for shock. Shock that has a good position here. Um, an aggressive position. And physics now has to be aware of, of his peak, he can't overpick this one here. Would not end too good for him if uh, Chocolate is doing his job right. Um, I feel like Friendly Fire, um, they don't make any movement yet. Maybe they do the same as Slither, but uh, people like who's far back there. I guess it's physics. No, 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 it's not. It's Cam. No, it's Mr. Lutz. It's a dead player. On the west side. Uh, they're not really aggressive. Upstairs. It's doggy dog. That's what I was talking. About. Yeah, I was talking about him. They they they're, they're staying far back. By the way, good good kill by Mister Lot again. Um, yeah, things are even now. They are staying back. Defense, defensive like slithered it on the attack round, but <laughs> their, their positions are even more far back. They they, they took two minutes on to create this line. Maybe maybe it's too. Maybe that took a little bit too long. Maybe it will be a problem later, timing-wise. I don't know. Um, uh, yes, be so extra careful. We have physics uh, trying to uh, see if there's somebody over those uh, pallets uh, that could pick over that wall. That uh, if he's going to cross the street, he's going to get killed right away from there. But uh, there is one in that area. Um, and Deadpool uh, next to objective. Right, Echo three. I just killed another one south. Oh, that's another kill for the break on that way on chocolate here. Oh yeah, there's the cross. Someone is behind the tank and uh chop. <laughs> oh C4 is coming now. Oh. It is over. Oh. <laughs> Beautiful one. Oh, that's how you do that. Wow, you better clip that. And I clipped like it, the man. video if you're here. Oh, another kill. He's that grenade. Physics is down. <laughs> Friendly fire with two players left. It's leader. Four of them. They are looking good to tie the game. And since you're already here, please like the video if you are enjoying the stream. Uh, subscribe as well. And. Uh, if you want to say hello to your friends, type it in the chat because there is going to stay there forever for them to read. So, yes, let's get on uh, to the game, doggy. Yeah, it's chocolate killing dog here. And you're right, guys. Uh, again, thank you all. I see all of you in the chat. Uh, I want to thank, so thank you all for taking a part of it. Chatting so actively, I'm seeing every message. <laughs> and if you like the stream, leave a like. Leave us a sub. Um, it's... And it's an amazing cast so far. It's an amazing match. It's a one against four. And man, it's not looking good, too good for friendly fire here. But uh, to be fair, um, both teams did not have the quick spawn. And I feel like the quick spawn is the only. It's, it's the only realistic way to have a good chance attacking this objective. The quick spawn is. Like if you have to, if you have the quick zone, you want to overrun the defenders. You want to do it quick, quick, bam, bam, to to just make the defenders mm. like miss I don't a know, lot. confused. Miss a, miss a lot trying to sneak in there. 
uh, which is always good if you get really close to objectives you might only have to fight one before uh, right to to get in range so uh that could happen and uh if she is a fast capper round could be over but um on the other side um, the east side of the map it's uh they uh, both team <clears throat> they dominated that part and uh, if you want to learn about how to throw a c4 we have chuck in their beautiful one. <laughs> oh, oh my god there is one oh just leaving one block next to objective um probably uh they are getting back out of somebody will retain yes we have two of them now the lot is on fire today and sadly chocolate could i know oh wow if Good i job had no chance from... if i had no chance yeah gg is so kilo did you what do you think was the mistake here from the attackers? Why why did they why did it seem like they had no chance? Yeah, well it it's it, I noticed that um uh most of them stay on the south side of the of the map uh and um and they didn't rush in uh, at least to to get uh closer to the main block, right? Being on the other side um, of the of the plaza area, um, but um, no, they were they were taking one by down one by one down, and uh, uh, when you start losing players too early, it mess everything up. Your plans are they have to change, and if you don't come out with a bright one, uh, probably you won't have a chance. The game is tied. This is early in the map, and I like what I'm seeing. So, Bazaar is being good for a leader, and uh, let's see if they could keep up yeah. with that record. You man, it's uh, both teams are doing a good job on Bazaar. We, I'm just letting the clips roll here because um, we have seen so many crazy things today. It's uh, it's insane. And it's the discourse are one one now, so everything can happen. Personally, I'm hoping for map three decider. That's always extra intense, extra fun. And we're now starting round number three. Let's go. Yeah, New objective. That's why you. New objective, and that's what you do at the beginning of every round. You get your tablet out and try to memorize that code, so it will be you. It won't be a hard time when you get to objective. Um, then a few uh, refresh of that number will do the job, and uh, you should be able to get in there, put that code pretty fast. Um, some people, they it, it's a hard thing to do to put the code uh, we get to see it uh, with um, uh, uh, about two seconds uh, the fastest in average but people could take up to 10 seconds doing it so and uh, you could die standing right next to objective almost to win the round but yes you need to practice and uh, most of these players they go do that every week so let's see what what's up Already one friendly fired down, and uh, and uh, yes, my, they're already my, around the corner. And teammate button here talking about slow cappers. Uh, it's always capping is something you maybe practice. Um, there, there are different ways to remember the code. Personally, what I do is just I um, well, what was that in the stream? I well, that was confusing. So something happened in the streamer. Uh, um. What I personally is, am doing is I'm repeating the code in my head really intense. Like every time, I'm only thinking about the code. Sometimes when I'm when I'm dead and in a tent, I'm still repeating it so intensely because I, I don't know. It's, uh, but I feel like my camping speed is good. Maybe it's a good method that I'm actually doing. Like I'm, yeah. What are you using? Code, what are you doing in your code head? Is, code is very important, but you still need yeah. to get there. And we have four of the Marshal team already, not too far from objectives. And uh, who knows? Uh, we might have a capture. Smoke is out. And uh, and uh, 
it could be, oh my god the street it is well blocked uh, a doggy that will have a, a sidewalk view but if they run cross to it and there's nothing that he could do they will get two objective stay the, there needs to be a smoke blocking doggy dog's view otherwise they can't cross he's, he's going to see them and he's holding his position pretty well as he just kid one maybe chocolate is now Oh, Cam here, nice kill on Mr. Morph. Nice kill, eliminated the west approach. And, uh, yes, they just uh, crossed the street. Oh, wow. Let's see, look at this. Chocolate getting killed from the Finally, way. yeah, Doggy Dog taking care of that sidewalk line uh, from the corner. He is... Uh, Oh, wow, that yeah. cool. <laughs> Getting physics. It is a uh, two-two game, two-three. Oh uh oh. Three, one against three in favor of Friday Fire now. We have Cookies as the last uh, Marsock. Uh, very hard job, but you don't need too much to get in there. Oh, just stay yeah, hidden. Reaction time. I clicked the wrong <laughs> replay button. Sorry. Well, Friday Fire. Getting this round and uh, they are ahead 2 1. What a peak as well from Cam. Um, and what an amazing defense here. Doggy Dog's position was amazing. He, he did an awesome good job there. He, I don't know how many he killed in the end. 2 3. That, that was nice. Amazing defense. Uh, and if you uh, defend this objective, if you have good positions on this objective, it's so hard for Marsox to do anything. Um, yeah. Yeah, there's so many ways to take care of this objective. Uh, if you notice, they need to cross the street to get to it. So if you just cover the street, you should be okay. And you might want to leave one player next to objective. But the smokes could get you confused and somebody could actually cross without any problem if the the street is well smoked. You could even cross a straight to objective. And as we know, you could capture the objective from inside the building to the outside. Uh, there's another outside area and uh, the uh, next to it. And uh, there's many places to hide too. If you get to objective, you just drop to the ground and even you will still be high uh, because there's so many things around the boxes and the same objectives could cover you. Um, so it is possible for a fast cap, but you just need to get there. Oh, yeah, I think uh, two smokes on a line could be maybe enough to, to block the full vision. Off the street and yeah. then across would be possible. As a marshal, I will take a two or three smoke and a smoke and a flash. That's what I always do. Um, and uh, yes, and you need help to cover. Even you need a uh, suppress cover to even to try to cover the sound because while you in there, they will hear you. But um, if you get to one side of the objective, they will take many seconds to get to you so you could actually cap quick and um yes let's see what they do over here exactly um they are now uh, friendly fire are having oh two guys on the on the, oh, on the motor here on the two story and they have contact with either chocolate deadpool or idiot soon <laughs> The other guys are going down the south. So, um... Yeah, everything does this differently. These objectives. I, I, I usually send someone to the dumpster across the street on the main uh, Broadway street. That guy could take care of the uh, west side and the main street. And uh, you have uh, many players left to do something else and probably back him up and keep him alive uh, but uh, this didn't happen they are all around in the same block area and um, a couple of them across the street 
and uh, if they don't trade or uh, you know get killed or trades if, if um, you shouldn't cross the street but uh yes let's see still early in the in the round everybody's alive and we have four more minutes to go God. Oh, idiot kidding cat you wow Very amazing nice position cook. and now it's rotating yeah, cook back is, yeah cookies did just that getting that kill which is makes it worse to to be on that side of the street Yeah, cool, right? Take, taking a look at the tablet and seeing who's still alive and probably uh, getting uh, his uh, code being refreshed in his memory. Shot is shooting in the air. I don't know what this is for. Maybe this it seems to him. be a drawn out. I mean, he's doing that often. I, I catch him doing this like two, three times now. Doggy uh, is down. Yeah, it's. Uh... <clears throat> Three against five in favor for Slither right now. It's it not looking out. too good for um, friendly fire here. And I feel like the defense here from friendly fire. Uh, the, the, the defense from Slither here is also good. No mistakes. I see no mistakes. No Miss positions alarm. being let open. Yeah, we have Miss Love right here, and uh, we have a new truck right in front of her, which uh, gives a different angles from the previous map. So you could look under the vehicle and uh, probably get some kills. Yes, a trade just happened between puts, uh, physics and chocolate. Idiot, uh, finish physics here. But Rogue Dice got him back, but. Is he forced get him rogue dice again? It's a three against one and a half. Mesodot needs to make a big rotation around now to revive her last teammate. Take a look on the ki I kills. Hope we look at this. Mesodot uh, here having the same. She is on fire. Yeah. She did it before and she could do it probably one more time. But I hope she has some utilities because she's gonna need at least a smoke. To cross, uh, she's giving a thought if she's gonna go for that revive, but uh, it all gonna depend on the callouts and maybe uh, his her teammate might be uh, telling her that uh, there is enemies in the area. I actually feel like Rogue Dice is not aware, maybe. Oh, and that's the second point for Slither. <laughs> Oh, very nice, Deadpool. Getting that kill. Just waiting patiently for that uh, uh, revive attempt. GG's. Yeah. Nice try here from both teams. I, I honestly also don't know. I, it's the Vogue advantage. Friendly Fire just has to continue. They, they have to continue with the Vogue advantage. And if they just continue winning Vogue rounds, then the next round for friendly fire is a rogue round. Then uh, map number two is a friendly fire win, and we have a map three decider. But both teams are equally playing equally in my opinion. Uh, it's yeah. Now this this the second map is now <clears throat> a good map. It's uh, um, as different as the first one. This one has even action. The score is tie. And uh, it's about who is gonna um, uh, do the best job, and uh, and defense have been good uh, this time because no one has been close to objectives in Bazaar. So uh, we're gonna see. We're gonna see. Do we have um, a new objective already? We do it's. Uh, I don't know how oh, to. Oh, we have this the one. center street. Yes. Center Street <laughs> objective. For those of you not familiar with that one, yeah. So Kilo shares your thoughts on this one. Uh, it's complicated. It's a it's a hard one to defend. What do you think? Yeah, we we I have a way to defend this. So you might 
you might have to play me so you could figure it out. I have a really good plan, but I don't know. Every team is different. Every player is different. You get to bring different guns and utilities. So uh, we're definitely going to see some C4 action one more time. Um, and uh, you could uh, capture the objective in many ways, indoors, outside, behind the box. And on the other building, if you... Um, Barely just outside the that um, cardboard box over there, if you are next to it, you could actually, um, uh, if you are low to the ground, you could sneak in there and cap. So, and and I seen also captures on the sidewalk, staying low in the ground, and um, you get some kind of covers in there too. So, let's see what they do and. Uh, we need to, we need to, we need more action. And you know what I want to see? A uh, capture. Who will do a cap for the first time in this uh, game? So, and uh, Slither, they have a chance to do that and take the map. So, will that happen? We'll see. We'll see yeah, soon. We have seen no cap yet today. Um, yeah. That's all. Like if you if you think about it, uh, seeing no cap or uh, no caps happening in a match is actually a good sign. It just means Vogue is doing their job right, you know. Um, basically, it's a compliment <laughs> that we that we saw no cap here. It's just a sign that both teams have been managing to defend the objective like they should mm -hmm. the, the whole match yet. Um, of course, they died. Yeah. There are Vogue rounds lost, but. Getting capped on is like the. I mean, it's the biggest loss well, you can get, you know. Let's see. Well, one more time, I uh, thank you guys for staying here with us and watch the game. B R M L. Uh, week one, first EU match that is being streamed. So I hope you are enjoying the show. I hope you are liking the video right now because there's so many of you in the chat. We get to see you. And uh, of course, be kind of subscriber. We wanna uh, make it all the way to the the BRMLCon, and hopefully, uh, we get your um, help. And uh, there's a um, um, what is it called? A um, donation page to try to get a. Uh, the best teams in there oh, so yeah. we'll soon you'll know about it i don't know if we got the link if somebody could put the link in the chat please take a look and uh see what we're planning to do uh, and 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 also if if you cannot donate subscribe to the channel it is very important for people to watch this because uh, we have a big team. We are a family and we put in our heart together to keep this going and we need your help. So like the video, subscribe, uh, chat, comment, and uh, if you could donate um, some in um, in this uh, link that I will show soon in the chat, uh, we'll try to get the best two teams fly into the BRML con. And he keeps Bravo. doing well. Maybe give Bravo. us the names for everybody to enjoy. No one in the... And guys, Who knows? We, we had so many issues, but uh, we are now here for the final round of this map. I am again sorry for the technical issues. And I hope you are still around. <laughs> um... Well, it's later. Uh, they're still trying. Uh, there's only two of them left. So, uh, smoke is going out. Um, we have Bernie. He's about to cross the street. Very dangerous thing to do. And made it next to Chuck. Oh my god. And Chuck, he just went down in front of him. Oh, making things harder. My god. Friendly fire. Having this round under control. And... In their pockets, yes. Bazaar was one 
by friendly fire and the match is tied one map each so we're gonna go for the third and the side of map ggs number wow. three will happen so okay what's the guess what's what's map number three gonna be i uh, <laughs> You might want to go to ads. Let's make sure these people buy some stuff from our sponsors. Let's, yes. Let's, let's have them watch this. Exactly. It's just good stuff, please. I'm hoping, this. I'm hoping for an abandoned and suburbia. Guys in the chat, let us know what's map going to be. See you in two minutes, two, three minutes, all right? Accept and ignore, just kicking down all the doors. Guarantee you, boy, fire for it. It's gotta be real big. I gotta make it just for my kids and for their kids. It's kids, that's wealth, years and years. Promise my brother, soon as he out to finish this bid, we finna do it bigger than anybody ever did. The odds is real big. Job, that's real big. Satan trying a little, my God, is real big. Stayed up on the grind on the cars, is real big. I gotta do it big. The only way that I can live. Accept and ignore, just kicking down all the doors. Guarantee you, boy, fire as for it. It's gotta be real big. I gotta make it just for my kids and for their kids. It's kids, that's wealth, years and years. Promise my brother, soon as he out to finish this bid, we finna do it bigger than anybody ever did. The odds is real big. Job, that's real big. Satan trying a little, my God, is real big. Stayed up on the ground on the cars, is real big. I gotta do it big. The only way that I can live.
Paquito again, flying out, rifle in hand, catches one, two, three. Oh, no! Been through this right now, the top place. And there's a double kill that comes in from Cozy can get to the EMP inside. Oh, my God! No, that's five, four, three, Hello guys, we are back. <coughs> map number three, decider map. Um, <coughs> oh wow, beautiful! We are in downfall. We were talking about downfall earlier, and uh, oh, yes, they picked, they picked this map. They pick this map, and uh, round one downfall. Whoever so downfall. wins this map will win the match. So they need to. Be very careful. Oh, I'm sorry. Quarantine. Ah, Happens. sorry about that. We are in quarantine. Yes, I'm. <laughs> yeah, uh, we are fully so confused, dirt. guys. So many issues happening. I hope oh you're still here. Oh and oh for context, um, friendly fire was managing to they get map number two. This is the deciding map. Who will be the winner of the first European match in the MA season 16? What's your guess? Drop it in the comments in the live chat. Um, we are all hyped for this one. And as you can see, there are no glowing buildings anymore. <laughs> yeah, match is tied. 1-1. One, one. Each team won a map. And uh, they didn't uh, win the map that uh, they picked, so they won the other team map. So let's see what's going to happen here. I'll put a grenade on him. Have you seen that? Thank you very much. Oh, oh my god. god. One in there. Oops. See if there's one upstairs. Beautiful. Uh, uh, he doesn't the know he got two, that uh, uh, that kill, but uh, it was a nice one. He's still alive, though. He's between the two, he's, he's in the alley between the two. He's in the it alley is Mister. <laughs> Mister is down. <laughs> I'm beautiful, I'm beautiful man. kill. Let me help you with the names here. Keep Thank going. You. It's a, uh, it's a lot of stress here right now. But this grenade on point. What, are, what what's happening today, man? It's insane. That's what I was talking about. The, the teams have the experience, but Burn is able to. No. He was almost able to see either physics or rogue dice. I'm I'm stuck here. Mm -hmm. Here we go. We are back in track. Sorry about all the messed up that we have done. Okay. First That's week fun. we are fairly <laughs> uh, new with a new system, but uh, we are back in, okay. and uh, we one, apologize if uh, we missed some action, but uh, we have the last round here, and. Uh, the most important one now. It's sad. Whoever wins this one will win. It's sad we have lost two rounds, but uh, the rest of it was a 10 minute timeout, so uh, the world is fine. We, we are still here for the biggest part of the match. Oh, nice. My good throw. And it's a 5 against 4 in favor for Friendly Fire. They are moving close to the objective, but Bernie is still holding them down. I'm not too sure if Bernie is. Able to catch him from this distance. I miss a lot wow, of flying and drone, I think, right? It is a drone. There is a drone out. Bernie getting one kill. And uh, friendly fires one player down. It's a four against 
floor here. Yeah, quarantine. This map, uh, we it's been always in the map pool. It just just got fixed in the last update. Um, few just um, building color issues, but uh, had the map had nothing wrong with it, so it was played in the last season. Now uh, it's back here for good and looking good. Now it's shot with one kill. Get this epic. And I said, yeah. Oh, this is a nice area. I like being in the wind area. But I'm uh, being a little bit back. Nice oh no, it's a TK. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> he immediately nice made his team kill uh, good again. Look at this. Yeah, double care for Deadpool. And it's a one against three now in favor for Slither. It was a one and against. No, it was a three against three. Well, oh, friendly fire, one player left. I'm pretty sure they will uh, forgive him this team kill. After what he just did, <laughs> they will forgive him. Yeah. Um, so, yes, a uh, minute to go, and uh, Cam Street, I, I think he's a new player in this round. Now uh, it's far from objective. Might not be able to get there, but uh, you still need to try. He might know who is left. Uh, might be one, two, and uh, he could get one, two, three kills in a few seconds. It didn't happen. And, and uh, we have the first point for a slider. Slider uh, winning the first point of the That's uh so far an amazing match we have many amazing clips happening we will go over them after after this map we review everything um, again one last time i'm sorry for all these issues we had um, but now let's focus on this amazing game on yeah, current yeah don't don't worry too much about it we are humans and uh, we are not perfect, but you could be perfect to us. Please like the video, follow <laughs> this, the, the, the channel, please subscribe. <laughs> and uh, don't forget to, uh, you, if you are not, you are here for the first time, you have, you must join the Discord server. All the information is in the description below. And if you are very kind, you might wanna donate in, my, in our GoFundMe page so we could get teams into the BRML.com at the end of July. So we need your help and we need your views. Please uh, help out and um, we'll make sure we continue doing this forever. <laughs> uh, and uh, yes, so, I'm happy to be here, Leander. I, I came here to help you out, and uh, uh, we're going to go through this just fine. It's just exactly. the beginning of the season, and there's a lot to watch. Surkiyo is getting ready as well, and a uh, lot of streams coming this way, so let's go. There are a lot of future cars happening. I am casting tomorrow. We have an Imperial against no fun intended cars happening this weekend. It's an epic week so far we, we we have had many epic and a cars happening too already it's gonna be a nice weekend it's gonna be a weekend full of content and this was just the first european cars and uh, another thing to add the team winning here today will be the first the first team in the european scoreboard european ladder <laughs> maybe just for yeah, a short amount of time but uh you can say you happened first. After yeah, we... let's go. That's right. Yeah, EU here. And this is the top teams. We have a diamond and a master team in here. They are fighting each other. They are showing us what they are made of. And um, and sorry, we didn't catch it all, but uh, we are here to get better and uh, bring you the best stuff in the world, best league. And uh, in the best game so let's go onward let's go be rml and uh yes we have a game in front of us sense um and so far uh, mr morph if 
is try to take control of the uh, burning house, blocking physics vision here. As soon as Mr. Morph is able to cross to the burning house and kill physics, they have a super important key point position there. Um, that might be what they are looking for. That's their goal. I mean, look at how tucked in all of the other four attackers are right there. It's insane, actually. And Morph is yeah, now crossing. Bernie killing Rogue. Rogue is down, Mr. Uh, right next to physics. And uh, yes, they smell each other. <laughs> uh, Sending Bernie. Wow. Classic building. It's no, it is not burning anymore, but uh, the name is um, <laughs> stay in it. Uh, not burning anymore. That's maybe. Yes. That was at the beginning of the game. This game is it been going on since 2016, and uh, it has progress. And now we have a uh, bunch of maps, and and a lot of game modes and this game is just getting better and better in each update uh, very happy to play it the i believe is the best game out and uh if you are you haven't tried uh just do it you will fall in love with it look at that we have chalk right here and um uh, they all crouching and standing and um and doing all the physical stuff that you see doing there they are doing it at home or where they are so VR virtual reality is the uh, best uh, feeling that you could have if you play video games definitely uh, onward VML is most one of the most intense gaming experience I've had the feeling of being inside the smoke trying to cap the enemies like enemies next to you you're honestly sweating. Yeah, that Pooja skit, that physics, and reviving it. Oh and yeah, that. That's happened. Idiot just went. Idiot cookies just went down, but I was not dead, so he got revived. You see that syringe on the floor. It was used to get him up again. Um. So yes, that is a a uh, choice that you get if you are down. A friendly could come and revive you. Burning dead. Cam getting Bernie. Three against three. And now Doggy getting that poo, but Chocolate may be able to get the refrag here. He knows where he's at. He's on the... Wow. Alright, it's a 3v2 game. That pool could be revived. Look and at this uh... position! <laughs> he's getting hit from Chocolate though, but... How can you reach this position? Oh wow, you just uh, walk up there to the tail of the plane. It, it will uh, get you half of your body covered, but the other half is exposed. So, and uh, too bad for him. He just got a uh, uh, kill because of that. Yeah, it's uh, crazy. Man, Chocolate should be definitely aiming for the revive here now on uh, Deadpool. Wow. Quarantine, beautiful map. It was played last in the last season. This was the championship map. Uh, you better watch that stream. That was an exciting one, and uh, and uh, you will learn a lot from that game. It was a lot of tactics going on, uh, and uh, exciting. One of the most exciting games. And miss a lot. Getting that last kill. Chuck is down. Good job, and the uh, game is tied. Friendly Fire 1, Slither 1. Yeah, points are 1-1 one, one on map number 3. <laughs> it's intense! Yeah, I, I... And, and you can notice the the, the teams having a little bit pressure. Um, wow, it's a so far an amazing game. I, I keep saying this like 50 times now, but just the... I mean, the, the way Mr. Lord peaked this was insane. Um, Chocolate just didn't expect it. And it's it's hard to see people peeking through that little gap. And it's also painful peeking through that. I don't know, have you seen that peek from Mr. Lord, Sukido? This uplink? 
Oh my uh, no. god. Uh, uh, there's a lot going on there. It's well covered and also it's dark in there. Um, um, so yes, uh, there's many ways to get in there, but a lot of action goes uh, in long range. There's a lot of killing from one side of the map to the other one. So they need to get some cover. The ball team needs to just wait and watch those line of, of crossing to it. And uh, they should be okay. Uh, every round is different. Every team is different. And every decision you take will make a difference. So do your best, help out your team. Uh, communication is key reporting stuff is key and uh yes the mission is to put that code in there it is seven digit code you could take us uh, two seconds to do it uh um, the sh uh, short time and a uh, few more but uh, you want to be expert on that so let's go we have a new round in front of us three starting now now we have the new objective and um, slither is defending this one um And look at the spawn from the fire ass. Um, they're now all crossing to the to this side. And actually called a, a defender on crossing. Uh, whoa. What's his defense? Um, spawn is on burning. And then they have two on each building. and. Wait, is are they actually? Oh yeah, look at this. They're almost seeing a de doggy dog. It's pretty close, idiot and Deadpool. Almost able to see him. Yeah, we're gonna ask our cookie friend. Maybe he could uh, get a new name. <laughs> we don't wanna <laughs> <laughs> call him by his first name. <laughs> or maybe swap it out. But uh, yes, we. it doesn't matter what is your name here. Uh, if you are a good player, a team will need your service. So yes, if you don't have a team, come check out the website. And uh, there's many, many, many teams that are looking for players. The season just started. This is week one. And uh, they all want to play. They all want to go to BRMLcom this July. So yes join the discord like the video and uh, get more info well, what makes this uh, season special is the con you just mentioned um people are gonna meet up in real life and they're gonna play against each other in real life in a few months after the season has ended um i feel like this adds a special feeling into this season right the fact that we know there's a lan event happening in a few months uh where a lot of Oh, a lot of other games are represented. Um, you should have been able to see that one quite a long time. And look at this, idiot! No, wait. <laughs> You're right. Let's call him Cookies, maybe. Um, I was able to kill that one and take off the bounce. <laughs> oh my God! Well, we lost the sniper on top of the hospital building, and it's called that way because there's an ambulance park next to it. Uh, some people uh, at the beginning I used to call it a uh, warehouse because it's more like a warehouse looking but uh, you have to go with the flow it is hospital and uh, and um, yes um, it doesn't matter how you call it but as long your team understand it you should be okay uh, but uh, we have missed a lot of getting for a revive she is getting all those points you know what I wish they do in the game Hey when me. you get a a half kill, you will should get a half a point. <laughs> you know, like you get a one point five kill. Oh, that, that would, would be, be cool. so confusing, man. <laughs> or maybe another list for the uh, <laughs> down sure, people sure or whatever. But uh, yes, uh, there's a uh, Bernie is hurt, but uh, he has to use that syringe. Well, it's leader. With, with four players and friendly fire as well with four players and we have two minutes and a half to go it's a really intense round so far we're not seeing many deaths but 
There's so much gunfire going on. Look at this chocolate killing missilots. Uh, that is a good kill since uh, the BIP just went down. Yeah, oh, look at that position of shock away from the wall, yeah, which yes. uh, most people will go to the front of the wall. Um, <clears throat> if you recognize the spawn area all the way in the northeast, being far from that wall makes sense. Uh, but if, if they are coming from the hospital building, then Chuck which will be open for a kill. But, uh, good job. Right, now it's Echo 3, Santa Bernard dead. Yeah, did they think it's an Echo 1? It's oh! Oh my god. Nice kill, uh, grenade. Yes! Well Oh wow. my god, Rosh, nice kill. He doesn't know about it. Oh. Uh, it was a, a full kill. He was not down. He actually get that full kill. And when that happens, you don't get to hear the... Uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, you uh... know? And uh, lately, people have been getting good in uh, in duplicating that. Uh, uh, going <laughs> That's down. what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's funny sometimes to hear that. Um, I'm doing this sometimes, and then I'm standing next to my teammate, and he's <laughs> laughing his ass off, and that's a win for Oh my! <laughs> All right, Mister, getting the last kill. Oh, man, I, I honestly don't remember seeing a, a match of so many epic grenade kills before. This is. We need oh, to do a you compilation. Oh, a few ones this today. One. Yes. Not, not a few. <laughs> For sure, like five or more. It's it's insane. Nice, and there was a nice a couple of C fours too. Good yeah, job. Yeah, chocolate with his C four throws. Well, we need well, to... good job for us leader. They they got this this point. They are ahead, and let me tell you, they only have five players in the roster team. They are playing right now. Uh, on the other side, friendly fire. They have a eight member team uh, players. So. They yeah. uh, they have the extra players and guess what? They started with four. Uh, sometimes it happens, but uh, it, it's with so many players in your list, uh, you need to be more careful. We have to remember this is the first week. Everything could go wrong, and I did for friendly fire in the first round. So now this is the third on um, the side round, and uh, I'm happy. Well, I'm a uh, witness, witness right now, so it is, it, is, it is a good, good match. EU, they never let us down. It makes me happy seeing all of you guys waited so long to catch the cast again. We still have a lot of you guys in here. And support your team, support the team you like. In the chat, who's winning, who's, who's losing. And... Man, I, I would be so brutal to ask you, Sakido. What do you think? Oops. What do you think? Who's more stable on this map? More confident and who maybe actually wins well, this? Well, it um, is leader. Uh, they are looking good. They are ahead and um, in a friendly fire, the first round, it was chaotic for them. Maybe bad luck uh, or bad communication, but uh, you never want to start your match with a bad round. Even if you get to lose, you want to lose in a good fight. But uh, first round of the first map was, was really bad and probably that affected them through the whole map. Uh, there was a timeout going on, so people are regrouping, taking a break, and uh, thinking over some tactics. And another thing that I've noticed in this match is like between rounds, they don't take the full advantage of the two minutes of them. So uh, yes, they need to actually plan and take advantage of those two minutes before the rounds. But they're doing it in this last map. 
Uh, other than that, I think uh, we should let the people see what our sponsors are offer. Right? So there's good stuff in the ads. Exactly. We have another 10 minute timeout happening, guys. Oh, I am... Okay, I see. <laughs> I'm sorry to let I you see. wait one more time. Um, we will give you a short ad break. We will come back and talk about this objective, though. Uh, it is um, so needs a break too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're he, back. He needs a toilet time. All right, see you guys in a. Accept and ignore, just kicking down all the doors. Guarantee you, boy, if I ask for it, it's gotta be real big. I gotta make it just for my kids and for their kids. Just kids, that's wealth, years and years. Promise my brother, soon as he out and finish this bid, we finna do it bigger than anybody ever did. The odds is real big, job that's real big. Satan trying a little, my God is real big. Stayed up on the grind on the cards is real big. I gotta do it big, the only way that I can live. Accept and ignore, just kicking down all the doors. Guarantee you, boy, if I ask for it, it's gotta be real big. I gotta make it just for my kids and for their kids. Just kids, that's wealth, years and years. Promise my brother, soon as he out and finish this bid, we finna do it bigger than anybody ever did. The odds is real big, job that's real big. Satan trying a little, my God is real big. Stayed up on the grind on the cards is real big. I gotta do it big, the only way that I can live. Again, flying out, rifle in hand, catches one, two, three. Oh, no! Big 
Ain't accepting, ignore, just kicking down all the doors. Guarantee you, boy, if I ask for it, it's got to be real big. I got to make it just for my kids. Team, we are back again. Um, quarantine shortly before the start of round number four. <laughs> what a timing, the round just started. All right. Then we are here starting in round number four. This OBJ in front of the burning uh, house. Friendly Fire is now defending, they have to pull this back, they have to um, win this world round. And then this goes at 2-2. It goes until 4, it's the best of 4. And this map is deciding the match winner. And another thing, Slither having the quick spawn here. The Deadpool killing Doggy Dog. But now um, they are actually aware of physics here, not able to. Oh my god, this headshot! Oh! <laughs> Chocolate! Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, guys. Uh, I'm not able to use the small replay window at the moment. It's just the reason if I do a replay, it's a full screen replay. Um, man. Don't worry about it too much. We have good action in front of us and a lot of utilities in the ground that I, I will always pick up. <laughs> yeah, it is a, it's a 3v2 game. And uh, yes, it's always good to uh, get a time out to, you know, put things in order. Um, so uh, one of the teams did it. I don't know which one um, got the timeout, but it was a 10 minute timeout. We are back in action and a lot of killing going on. And Chuck is down. He was pretty active in this map. We got to see him a lot in the screen, but uh, he is dead. It is very early in the map. Uh, about two minutes passed by and four more to go now. Uh, they need to uh, go in a smart way because this is it this is the last map and you wanna win it and whoever gets the victory in the map will win the match but it's not just that we are fighting also for points every round that you win will count so you, you don't wanna lose any yes beautiful this defense looks solid so far. Um, it looks good for Friendly Fire at the moment. Four against two. 
Last two uh, Slither players is Cookies and Bernie. Yeah, they are in a hospital area. Objective is just across the street. <clears throat> but uh, the ball team, they know where are they coming from. They are shooting uh, on that direction. Um, and uh, we have one um, hidden inside Cerner Burning that definitely should be able to um, take a, uh, a view of the west and the sorry the south and the west of the building and oh my god bernie just went down we got cookies the last one alive which we're gonna ask and vote for a name change <laughs> <laughs> so hopefully uh yes and uh it looks like this round this map is gonna be tied to two yeah, yeah, it's at the it, moment. Friendly fires. Yeah, to too, too too many for him to to go, but uh, it's not over yet. Maybe, <laughs> maybe yeah, it's not over here. Turn us around. Yeah, well, you gotta see that. I understand that uh, the objective um is covered by the building and a wall, and you could hide behind them. Now, if he gets to the side of the wall. He only needs to worry about one, the one that is in center burning. Uh, but still, he needs to cross. And for that, Roach on the on the south uh, west side of the map, he just can't see him, and uh, it's gonna be hard because probably he have no utilities to block that view. Still, a minute and twenty seconds more. To the round to be for the round to be over and uh it's not looking good for cookies absolutely not he's just running around trying to kill anyone and uh, it almost worked oh my god yes <laughs> he need to kill him first and then kill the one in center burning to actually have a chance to capture next to the wall but now it didn't happen and Physics was able to take cookies out. Point number two for Friendly Fire. Scores are 2-2. Two, two. Oh. <laughs> this is... Oh. Uh, yeah, and this is when it gets interesting because a capture will get the game over. And... And... Um, that could happen in any any of the teams that they could do it yeah. and uh well there's a chat who's gonna be marsak this time um this time we actually have friendly fire will be Mars. Yeah, no, yes, sorry uh it's leader yes no, 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 they could fire capture the be... friendly fire it's yes gonna... they they could do a nice uh tactic smoke their way in and capture so so We'll see what objective is next because that will make a difference. Yeah, exactly. I feel like this is the second bazaar now. It's getting interesting again. Everyone is. Uh... <laughs> I honestly don't know what to expect. If if they just continue winning the work rounds, then it's gonna be a it's gonna be a slither win, right? If uh, uh -oh. no master rounds are getting. Oh, I'm, I'm always good for for captures it doesn't yeah. matter how many you give me if you capture the objective uh, it's always fun to be next to that person and uh, you know and the 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 happiness they join us that uh finished the round with that kind of victory with two points it's always exciting the most exciting part of this game uh, that I, I would like to capture so and uh this time if that happens it's gonna be the last uh point of the match so let's see what they offer us so it's round number five a cap could decide everything but a loss would be problematic here friendly fire against Hilda. and look at doggy dog checking this cross here and mr moth is going for the cross no he just baited it. <laughs> well, we are in quarantine. This is Utah, and this is not too far for BRML. Come, 
this July. You just pay the 15 down and you will get there. And uh, it is on the construction. It is uh, a plane went down, so the freeway is closed. <laughs> Anyways, I'm always uh, fun to go through this map, um, but uh, yes, we have a game and uh, let's see, let's see who will win. Don't forget, July, that I believe is the last weekend of July, BRMLcom. Get your information in our website, our Discord uh, server, and of course, right here, just ask. Chats. The tickets are actually now out for sale. You can actually now purchase the, the, your, your, your tickets for the VMA Um So, Q, will you be there? Will, will you actually, I just, had, I just had a nice conversation with one of the caster, and uh, it, it might happen. Nice. I'm able to do, uh, I'm able to, to do it. I'm an adult. I, um, I'm a cool i could uh, pay my way in and so it might happen Um i have been in colorado nice state very very uh greens areas and mountains and uh all beautiful to be there and i like uh, uh <laughs> special laws that there are over there so i might be there so if you want to meet Kio, come over yeah. yeah if you want an autogram from him <laughs> <laughs> Look at this attack. Oh they my are, god. Yeah. Well, moving. let's go back to the game. It's a lot. Yeah. yeah. They're moving slowly but dangerously. No one died yet. Only a few contacts. I don't know. Maybe just only pre fire. Both teams don't know anything yet. And. I mean, why? They have to. This, whatever this is here, let's take a look at what with chocolate and physics, man. <laughs> Look oh, how close uh, This is a nice position. I like this one because uh, with a, a nice uh, grenade, you could paralyze the one on top and maybe uh, go around the building and hit him in the back. Uh, all you need to do is just hear him. And uh, you might need two flashes to run from there, but uh, one will do it. Maybe, maybe and, uh, he does a C4 throw again. Mr. Lord able to kill Mr. Morph. Look at this beautiful kill. That's not a beautiful kill. Uh, Don't worry about it. We have the... Uh, oh, wow. Oh, the smokes. They're trying to enter here, I guess, right? Nice. Almost. That was a nice try, though. Oh, Doggy Dog killing nice chocolate. Physics tried to team kill Doggy Dog, but uh, luckily was able to being stopped. And it looks like Friendly Fire is now having a chance to be breaking the Volk advantage and actually getting a Master Ground. And look at this, the OBJ is smoked. Bernie killing Physics. That poor miss a lot. Situations are swapping again. It was a 5 against 3, now it's a 3 against 3. Wow, yes. A lot going on, and the smoke will cause confusion, always. Um, so let's see what they decide to do. M Street is going to entry now soon. Idiot is here, uh, peeking us really aggressively. Oh, almost. Cam Street now here. He's. Uh, Going to have a contact soon with Deadpool. Doggy Dog is going for the flank behind. That's also gonna be a interesting oh one. Is he going God. downstairs? He's... He is going downstairs. Oh, he's yeah, he's not too far from objectives. Just on the north side of the tank courtyard. He is uh, open for a kill if uh, we have um, someone aiming at him from the north, maybe from hotel, motel, or the. I don't know what happened to the. Oh my God, Doggy. Scanning kill oh, from Bernie! Oh. I didn't have it on my radar. Oh. oh my god, he was waiting and hiding behind that corner. In the cold. It is happening. Come on, you have a few seconds left! What? Oh, he stopped! No, he's getting that to too! He can't cap! Why is he, he dropped his tablet! Oh. oh no! Oh my god! You dropped his tablet! He is flash, he just Oh! Oh what? my god, that was close! 
Oh my god. Oh, you have to see that again. Oh my god. I don't know what happened. It took a lot longer to try to put that code, but he couldn't do it. So he went for uh, the kill. I believe he heard that defender coming at objective. Um, but uh, yes, uh, he got the kill and um, I guess he got flash. I didn't notice because he was kind of paralyzed. And then uh, he got um, <coughs> a kill. Just this, in an easy way. This this should have been a camp. From... Wow, he could have been just. Wow. The, the, the mistake was he, he was aiming for the cap. Can you even cap where you try to cap? I don't know. Maybe it wasn't possible. But then he did the mistake to just drop the tablet. He, he just dropped it, moved forward, killed Deadpool. He killed the defender. And but then, um, yeah, he was flashed. And then he was there with his empty hands trying to cap. And then Bernie was able he to secure the OBJ. He had to be flash. Yeah. Uh, because uh, yeah, he didn't move. He lost the tablet and uh, or maybe, he just hoping. Maybe he was just a, standing uh, in the corner with his tablet in the hand, uh, with not his tablet in the hand, and he was like, "All right, you know what? It's over. I give up." <laughs> Watching his empty well, hands. <laughs> yeah. Well, it doesn't matter now. Uh, places. Uh, they switch places, so now the other team have the chance to capture the objective. Uh, we could still see a capture. Could be one round, could be and two rounds. We are closer to the end. There's no a winner yet, so it is coming pretty soon. So don't miss this two last rounds, one or two last rounds. Exactly. Um, friendly Fire losing this round means losing this match. But Friendly Fire winning oh. this round means it's going to be a last decider round. It's an epic match. It's a close one. And look at the spawn they have. Wow. Well, yes. Also, um, sometimes you get an easy code and sometimes you get a very hard one that no number is repeated easy or close codes, to each uh, other. Mentally a boost. Oh! Yeah. How does he survive? Oh, he only got hit twice and in uh, his body, probably a body armor. He survived us and now uh, he can give the information. That's, him. Oh that's the God. best thing to ever happen. Oh kill over here. Flashed. That was oh flashed. One kill. Rogue, rogue, rogue. No. My God. Oh my God. That pool. Wow, with a refry. Uh, most likely he didn't get a uh, flash because the flash landed on, An the, epic on the other side of the AC unit. Look at this. Yeah. Look at physics. physics. Nice kill, but it is a dangerous position to be. Yes. You don't get to see too much and they will see you first and that what just happened. Oh, no. Nice a sniper shot. Now it's a free against three, man. It's uh, what happened here? Oh, sniping, but not not the connecting. Guy, uh, blink revived. He's still there. That was an action, the the most action uh, filled one and a half minutes of this match. Yet. That we're getting Cam Street, amazing sniping shot. Two against three. Nice kill. It's not looking oh too good. Oh my god! Slither with a. Uh, um... Oh my god, getting a, a couple of kills, leaving friendly fire with one player, and he, he dies, the game is over. Oh All my god, he's, down. he's in the open. Oh my god, oh my god, GG's, this game is done. We know who won. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, good job. Don't say wow, him. what a kill. What a kill. And uh, yeah, there was nothing that he could do. He was in the open and that was an easy kill. And uh, yeah, just like that. We have two quick last rounds and um <laughs> and uh, this is it guys. We have to win this is uh, it. Man. Yeah. That was Amazing. Honestly, a really nice try from uh, physics and rogue dice. So the flank, 
on the AC roof. That was insane. But then the, the mistake that Rogue dies, uh, just assumed there's one on the AC roof and didn't went seeking for another. If he, if he would be killing the second one on AC roof, this round would have been a, a one round. That's my call. If, if he would be checking that, they would honestly be winning this round. But uh, he did this really small mistake. And I think that that's like a... That well, started the long matter right now. Slither winning, and I now was... Slither has four points. Take a look on the scoreboard, guys. Um, Egress wasn't that close, but the other two maps totally happened. So, Kelly, what can you say about this uh, whole match in general? Oh how do you feel? God. I was entertained. I hope you were too. Nice match. Uh, sorry with the uh, um, uh, stuff that I've been going on. We missed a couple of rounds, but uh, we did get the last map nicely and uh yes this is over we have a winner slither got this uh, win we there are only five players that that they have and good job for them um until then um please uh like the video subscribe don't forget of course to uh check the discord information brml discord and uh and uh yes uh thank you for watching I'm gonna say goodbye for now. I'm gonna uh, thank you, uh, Lender, for uh, asking me to join you in this first stream. I'm very happy to be here. Hopefully, I did all right, and I uh, hope you guys like the, the job. And uh, we're just getting better, so uh, we'll see you soon. I'll see you next time, Lander. Yeah, thanks. Thanks, as co -cast. Uh Thank you for tuning in. Um, make sure to check out um, the other cars happening in the next few days. Go on the YouTube channel, go on the live category and you see three other cars. Check them out. It's, uh, they're, they're insane games happening and being casted tomorrow in two days and in three days. The whole last week. Uh, that's it from us. Thank you very much. Catch you guys and see you. Onward VRML is brought to you by Downpour Interactive. Helga, the eSports Manager. Thanks for watching VRML.